Exactly on the top of everyone's party list. That's no, true. but you're on his. Yeah, sure it is. Here's the Neanderthal on the epaulets. Oh, that's General Stark. I don't like him very much. The uniform. Smile. I think he's on his way over. Miss Delafield, I was delighted to learn that you were in Washington. Seeing you again makes our trip worthwhile. You're too kind, General Stark. May I present my fiancé, Robert Scorpio? My pleasure. He's a very lucky man. Thank you, and welcome to Washington. A beautiful city, your capital. Well, I've not visited yours. Ah, what a pity. 
You must. Now, if you'll excuse me. I didn't like him there, and I don't like him here. What do you think of his boss? Ah, oh, Camargo's different. He's a real, he's a real gentleman. You know, and he really, he adores music. So did he. Look, let's uh, amble over and be introduced. Wait, wait, wait. What? Why the sudden interest in Camargo and Santa Demoro, eh? One day I might be in need of a holiday. <laughs> well, you're not taking me there. Didn't enjoy it the last time? Yes, yes, I did. But once is enough. And don't think for a minute <laughs> that I believe you. Champagne? Yeah. Relax. <laughs> As they say in Santa Moro, let's party. <laughs> Pleasure to finally meet you, Mr. President. I agree. All these others bore me. And forgive me if I say it's more of a pleasure to see Senorita Della Field again. Uh, it is still Senorita. <laughs> yes, it is. What is wrong with the men in your country? Eh? <laughs> I don't know, but it's an interesting question. <laughs> Which you are too much of a lady to answer. Huh? Yeah. Uh, American women. There is nothing like them, don't you agree? Ah, yes. Uh, Catherine's in a club all by herself. I wish you could play for me again. Well, maybe that's possible. But when do you leave Washington? My plans are not certain. I'd love to hear the Mozart again. Just the way you played it for me the first time. When was the first time? Tell me, how have things changed in Santa Mara since then? Under El Presidente's direction, things, as you call them, are going very well in our country. Thank you, Mr. Well, Scott. I'm not too familiar with your part of the world. You must remedy that, then. What would you like to know? <laughs> politics, politics. Always politics. <laughs> well, you're in the right place. I prefer to discuss your American composers. Copeland, Gershwin. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> All the best. Oh, oh, you <laughs> Of your choosing, but of course. Oh, okay. Uh, well, doesn't have that funny stuff. Oh, yes. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. Now, tell me. You know about this genius named uh, Ives? Yes, yes, Charles Ives is from uh, New England. Oh, you are familiar with his work then? Huh? Yeah, well, yes, I am, but I'm more impressed that you are. I mean, uh, of course, your music. Uh, oh! 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 I didn't even see it. Well, he just, he, he staggered and, and then he fell. Maybe I can help back. Get in there, everyone. What is it? Oh. I fear he's been poisoned. Oh. And she did it. What? I saw you hand it to Don't me. Don't be ridiculous. This is cat. Like I'm moving your dad. 